Tim's concerned that um, people won't realize, won't believe that we're actually at Comic Con, that we're faking it. We could show them your dress, Comic Con dress. <laughs> oh yeah, here's my <laughs> Comic Con dress. This is like this huge bag that like freaking WB was giving to everyone. I mean, it's big. Like, it's, like Tim, go put it on. <clears throat> okay, like this is how big this bag is, and everyone like. People were, you know, grabbing them like they're crack. And uh, so then I thought, wouldn't it be great to, like... Look, it's, it's how big more than two Tims wide. Yeah, I know. We were thinking, like, how awesome would it be to, like, turn this into, like, a dress or a sarong or something and then just wear it. Like, wear it around Comic-Con. I bet someone will do it. I hope someone does so, it. So it's a vintage Izod Lacoste polo shirt. Yeah. Which you can tell because it has a little... Blue alligator yeah. instead of a green one. Yeah. And my friend Kath has said it made my eyes look electric blue. They do. I noticed that earlier. I don't know if we can, like, see. Can we see? I'm trying to open my eyes wider. I've yet to show off my electric blue eyes to anyone in particular except you, interweb audience. <laughs> Which is very fortunate for all of us. Oh. Me especially. Oh. Because I wouldn't be anywhere without you. Yes. Well, that's true. Because Cavalcade, Cavalcade of Boys and Young Bottoms in Love had, like, a huge internet following. Yeah, so you'll have to uh, make sure you explain to people uh, how what, what sort of fans I have. I'm happy to be sharing Comic-Con with you <laughs> at our hotel room, our beautiful hotel room. Our beautiful hotel room. The TV. Did you even notice that before? I noticed the TV, but I don't really watch television. I watch YouTube. <laughs> and if you're watching this, then you're watching YouTube right now as well. 